all right what is up everybody i am you already know who it is it is erica carter the black belt broker and today guys i am in avalon park area right off of where am i right off of 79th street so guys let's go in the inside and see what we got we have a brick ranch here and okay let's see what we got okay guys so like i say um it's a brick ranch from the outside it looks decent i noted that the roof was shot so the roof definitely cannot be saved Ooh, yikes kind of rough in here anyway uh one saving grace you see that little coat closet i see hardwood floors so these floors can be refinished so that's one thing worth saving i see the windows have been updated they look pretty in decent condition actually um this is the living room that we're in um i would definitely get rid of this wall right here i don't even know why it's there open it up so you see we just got the living room so let's see how else this house is spaced out because the house Theoretically, it's 1,100 square feet, so that should be good enough. So we'll go in the basement in a bit. Let me back up. So bam, living room. This is a pretty interesting concept. I would get rid of this wall right here, definitely. But so far, so good. I like this big kitchen. Um, yeah, nothing in this kitchen can be saved. I see those windows are newer. They just look so weird. I don't know possibly could be saved so anyway guys here we are at our first bedroom um decent sized bedroom for a ranch home looks like it's about 11 by 11 pretty good i like that i like the fact that it didn't have a dining room already theoretically this is probably a dining room and dining rooms are not that functional anymore so it's better off as a bedroom so here we have another bedroom nice size like i say guys these floors can be saved possibly so you see the condition here of these windows they're shot these windows can't be saved but those windows in the front they were actually kind of decent um oh look at that porch yikes Whew. thought it was trying to get me it is in the inside that moth I almost flew on my mouth anyway um off jump that porch gotta go and that garage looks really, really rough. So you have to consider that into your rehab costs. So let's continue on. Like I say, this is a decent sized bedroom. I like the window there, I like the window there. We got our first bathroom right here. I mean, it's a decent sized bathroom, I mean, whatever. You could always spruce it up. So we have this, uh-oh, we got a back door here. So guys per the assessor if you have to walk through a door to get out of the house or get to another room it's not truly a bedroom so what we're standing right here even though it got the windows it got the closet come on you got the back door right here so this is not a true bedroom it'd be a true bedroom if you um you know Closed, uh, there you go, closed off this door. That's very weird. So they did some reconfiguration Ning already. So um, this closet look a little suspect. I'm not even gonna open that. But like I say, if you look at the layout of the house up here, this main level has ample square footage for a great and, pop, uh, great and proper flip. And why is the door open? Let me make sure ain't nobody walking up on me. All right, let me close this door. Because now we're going in the basement. Hopefully the basement ain't too rough. Let's see. It's currently no lights on in here, but that's all good. Ooh. Okay, so the basement gonna be shot. <sighs> right now we see evidence of water damage, especially you know how it was raining yesterday. So um I know it's gonna be a total washout down here, but oh nice, nice. I just wanted to see how big it is. Hold on, guys. So you see we got water here and it smells like mold finding well oh yes so hold on y'all so here let's just scroll slowly 
So what I'm looking at, guys, I'm looking at the space of the basement. I'm looking at the height of the ceilings. And I'm looking, hey, is it functional? Yes, it's functional. And then look, guys, the floor, you know, it's pretty decent. It's not no big dips or whatever. Okay, so you see we got a bathroom framed up here. Nice. So what I say on this house, I think this house is a definite go. I like it. Like I say, Brick Ranch are investors' favorite property type because, you know, it's pretty sellable and, you know, it doesn't require too much work. And right now I'm looking at the pipes, so the plumbing definitely has to be updated. Okay, you see they got a newer system here, so, hmm, I see a whole lot of value in this house. So, guys, with that being said... If you have any comments, questions, concerns, any properties you're considering buying and you just don't know and you need some assistance, please, guys, hit me up. I would love to help you guys. And that's what you call the stack. That's for the toilet and sewer line. So, all right, guys. I'll see y'all later. Peace.